Hi, a student came up to me and uh, asked me this question, so I'd like to do this problem for you. This is the integral of the natural log of 2x plus 3 dx. Uh, we're going to use what's called the z-substitution and integration by parts. Uh, first, uh, we're going to use the z-substitution here. We're going to let z equal the inside of this, which is just 2x plus 3. We take the derivative of the left side which is dz. We take the derivative of the right side, which is uh, 2 dx. And then the plus 3 goes away. Solving for dx right here, dx is equal to 1 half dz. And that's going to be substituted. I'm going to use a different marker uh, into this uh, portion right there. Basically, what we just did is what's called the u substitution, which you should all be familiar with. Except I'm calling it the z substitution because you're going to use integration by parts, which has u, dv. So I don't want to get those mixed up. So uh, putting in here, that's equal to, I'm going to put the 1 half out into the front, always factor out the constants. Integral of natural log of 2x plus 3 was z, and then dx is 1 half dz, so it's dz right there. Now we're going to use what's called integration by parts. Uh, usually the more, this one portion, the first portion, we're just going to call it u right there, and then we're going to call this right over here dv. And if you take the derivative of u, you'll get 1 over z dz, so it's going to be a really nice uh, variable to work with. So right here, I'm just going to put it right on the side. Uh, we're going to let u equal to natural log of z. That means taking the deriv derivative of u is du. The derivative of natural log of z, you should know this by now, which is 1 over z dz. Okay. We're also going to let uh, dv is equal to dz. We're going to take the integral of both of these now. And the integral of dv is just v. The integral of dz is just z. We know that our formula is going to be something like this. Integral of u dv is equal to uv, just like uv to light, minus integral of v du, like u to u to uv, v du. Notice it's totally opposite. uv to light, so easy way to remember, okay? This comes from the product rule, and you might, I might do a pro, uh, another video on the product rule. It only takes about two minutes to create this product rule proof. Anyway, so let's get back. Uh, I always like to write the formula out to help you guys guide through the problem. So that's equal to uh, one half. You factor out one half. U is right over there, which is natural log of z times v. Uh, what is v? v is z right there, minus integral of v, where z is z, times du, where is du? du is 1 half, 1 over z, dz, and that's just going to equal 1 right there. So, um, that's equal to 1 half, a z times natural log of z, minus, a z times 1 over z is 1, so what's the integral of dz? is just z and then plus constant. You can factor, I mean you can distribute the constant out, I mean it's one half out. Uh, you'll get a new constant, I really don't care. Uh, neither should your teachers. Um, we're almost done and that's equal to one half. Now we back substitute uh, z. z was right over here, 2x plus 3. So it's 2x plus 3, there's z times the natural log of z, which is 2x plus 3, excuse me, and then minus quantity of z, which is 2x plus 3, and then plus the monster constant z, because it is an indefinite integral. If it was a definite integral, we just evaluate it from a to b, evaluate this from a to b as well, and then you'll figure out, and then the constant will go away, and a definite integral. So if you have any questions, uh, let me know, guys. Um, and this is your answer right over here. Uh, hope it helps with your homework. Uh, this is for calculus BC.
uh, I don't know why some of you guys, uh, if you're doing integration by part, that's part of BC program and should be not uh, AB. So uh, the teacher should hopefully be knowing that. Um, anyways, uh, good luck with your homework and on your AP exams. Thank you guys. Bye.